Now you might wonder, what does that now mean? The good news is they didn't refuse you. The bad news is you need to take 12 months now to upskill yourself, to make sure that you cover all of those 11 outcomes sufficiently and that you operate on the right level. Use your 12 months wisely. If you overshoot that deadline, then you have to do a full application and pay full fees. So, go and update your, your training and experience report, update your engineering report, make sure you cover it sufficiently, and then you resubmit. And it's not going to cost you extra money, unless you overshoot the 12 months. If you can't do it within those 12 months, then you can write a letter to EXA explaining why you can't, and there's a possibility that they could extend it for another 12 months. This option you can only use once. That's in a nutshell what abeyance is all about.